<laughs> Here's a very, very funny man, and I'm told now, making his 40th appearance with 40th. us. 40th appearance with us here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, the funny Jake Johansson. <laughs> Wow. Um, okay. I've been a little bit worried because I read that experts are now saying that uh, global warming and climate change is inevitable. Like, we're not going to be able to stop it. So, I bought a hat <laughs> with a pretty big brim um, because I didn't have enough money for a politician. Um, <laughs> So I'm, I've got the hat, I'm wearing sunscreen. It, it took me a while to get on board that we have to wear sunscreen all the time now. I mean, that's my age. When I was a kid, we didn't wear, nobody wore sunscreen. My mother used to rub on baby oil and lie on a sheet of aluminum foil <laughs> in our backyard, you know? Is that all you've got? <laughs> she, she was daring the sun to kill her, you know? But uh, the, the sun was not able to kill my mother at that time. Um, and she's fine now. She's, she's in her 70s, and uh, she looks a little bit like a saddle. Um, <laughs> so it may be a little bit of sunscreen is a good idea. Um, but that, that's the thing. I, I feel like we're losing our, our minds about the sun all the time. I was in the camping store, you know, one of those outdoor stores, and they were trying to sell a shirt. Where the guy says, this is a good shirt for camping because it has a built-in SPF. And I was like, well, yeah, it's a shirt. <laughs> Yeah, th and now uh, that's, I believe that all shirts have a built-in SPF and uh, our pants and our underpants and uh, this roof is, uh, we're very safe from the sun in here. Um, but they're trying to scare us. That's how they get you going about it, everything now. And, uh, with the global warming, it's the polar bears. That's another one where they're all upset about like, how are you gonna feel when all the polar bears are dead? Bad. <laughs> I, I don't want the polar bears to die. I, I like polar bears, but I don't know what am I supposed to do about it, you know? I've already bought a hat. Uh, we, we could take up a collection and buy hats for the polar bears, but they're not gonna wear them. They're not gonna wear them. Um, I don't, I don't, I'm not a bear expert or anything, but uh, polar bears, they won't wear hats. No bears that really wear hats, you know? Um, Yogi Bear, but that is, yeah. That's, uh, yeah. that's, that's cartoon bear. They just draw the hat on him. Um, but uh, that'd be a good reality show, though, too. We're going to give this guy $100 to go put a hat on that bear. Um, and I, yeah, I'll tell you something. It's going to be hard to find the second guy to put a hat on a bear. Um, but, uh, like... Well, I'm not a bear expert. Like I said, I've only seen polar bears uh, on TV or the zoo. Um, I suppose that's where I get my perspective. You know, if you live someplace where they have polar bears, you know, like where you go out of your house in the morning, there might be a polar bear out there. Uh, then one day you turn on the radio and they say, hey, there's no more polar bears. 